Hello everybody and welcome back. I just wanted to quickly give you guys an update on the latest patch notes. It's actually it's pretty relevant to a couple of tutorials I've done in the past, making them pretty much irrelevant. This is going to save us quite a bit of time and a little bit of headache. So what Sony's done is, if you go ahead and select something, I'm going to go ahead and select, oops, go ahead and select this design here. And if we go in and copy and paste it now, and then if we go into tweak mode, we have this new option called Paste Air. And if we leave it checked, it's going to behave like it did before, even though this is still a little bit buggy. Let's go ahead and move this guy out of the way a little bit. Let's move it somewhere over here. That's good enough. And we paste it into our floor or wall or whatever it is. We hit the check mark. You can see we still get the old behavior. The empty air still has some form of data and it cuts away into your wall or your ceiling or whatever it is it might be. If we go ahead and copy and paste again, and we go back into our tweak mode, and we uncheck this guy, and then move it down into our floor, and just hit yes, you can see it behaves just like zero data voxels, and just like the inlaid pattern idea, but it saves us so much more time. So if I go ahead and select this guy and copy it up a bit, it'll even work with smoothing. I'm going to go ahead and select this entire thing real quick, and we're just going to smooth it down. That's pretty good. And then we'll cut out a smooth slice here. Just select it. That's pretty good. And we'll go ahead and copy and paste it. And we'll throw it somewhere down here on the ground. We'll go shift-click for our tweak mode. We've got paste air unchecked. And then if we hit OK, we've still got a smoothed out outline here nice and flush, and we don't have the empty air sort of cutout that we would normally. So I think this is great. So unfortunately some of the tutorials I've made pretty much makes them a moot point now and uh, they're kind of useless, but you can at least understand the concept behind it. And one quick thing I have noticed since the latest patch is when I smooth stuff, unfortunately it's not smoothing away things I've layered in. Like this is, this is still cubed up and basically looking like squares. And you can see it's a little bit buggy here as well. I'm not quite sure why that's happening, but uh, with some more trial and error, and hopefully an update on the forums, we'll find out soon, and who knows? Maybe it is a known bug and they'll, they'll patch that fix in. But for now guys, you can basically skip the zero data voxel technique and the inlaid patterns idea. And just remember to go ahead and when you paste, go into tweak mode and check or uncheck this guy. Alright guys, that'll do it for this episode. I just want to give you guys a really quick update and let you guys know that, uh, well, this is beta and things are bound to change. And some things will eventually become irrelevant, at least certain techniques. So until next time, guys, I'll catch you later. Take care.